Hi everyone, you're listening to Making a Mess, a mini series with Signal Arts. Today we'll be engaging with our natural surroundings and environment to leave behind our judgment, mark, make, and make a mess. Firstly, I'd like to acknowledge the stolen land that I stand on today of the Wurundjeri people of the Kulin Nation and pay my respects to the elders past, present and future. Acknowledge that sovereignty was never ceded and the continued struggles of First Nations people and their land and sovereignty. Today I invite you to go outside and collect some natural or found objects that catch your eye. Using paper and your preferred medium, maybe pen, crayon, pencils, pastels. You will select one or a few of your objects and draw them without looking at the page. You may draw them continuously without lifting your hand off the paper or you may choose to jump around the page and go from object to object. Our next exercise will be using our touch and by closing our eyes we will feel the object with one hand and draw simultaneously with the other. You may decide to draw abstractly what you feel or attempt to draw the shape of the object as you feel it. Our last warm-up exercise we will again on paper close our eyes but this time listen to the noises around us. You may choose to use both your hands and whatever medium. You can let your eyes move your hands. It may be to a song you've already been playing. It may be the birds in your yard or the street. It may be cars passing or roadworks. Our next exercise requires paint, so let's pour out a few colours, maybe mix some together that you'd like to use, they may embody the way you're feeling or how your environment feels to you. And with all your natural found objects, I invite you to explore mark making with these objects, use them as your tools. You may choose to dip or stamp. Use some as a brush to scratch or press or paint around. You can use them to slap or hit the page. You may have found something to roll around on the page or canvas. Don't be afraid to dirty your page or layer your marks. Make colors you may not normally use. You may treat it like an experiment or as a form of expression. The last exercise, we invite you to create a landscape using the same tools. It may be a landscape you remember or have been to. It may be a figure of your imagination. We hope you enjoyed this video and you got to exercise your creative freedom and make a mess.